So Let's Talk Games is a student conference hosted here in Leamington Spa, where we've invited some of the largest game studios in the country to give talks on a range of topics, so some on audio, some on character um, design. Um, we've even got a um, chapter on Playground Games coming in and doing a live demonstration using ZBrush, um, and a Hollywood concepts artist who's worked on some of the major household blockbuster films, um, showing his process for, for concept art as well. It's a fantastic event. Um, it's in its fifth year. It's growing every single year. So today I did a talk for the students here about creative process and a little bit how, how it can be nice and useful to experiment with the artistic process to, to become more creative. I certainly know from when I was a student that it was always nice to hear sort of nuggets of information from professionals that, that would sometimes it would just be like all right whatever and sometimes it would be a proper like aha moment that you, you never thought of so I, I hope that the students today got got something like that from me. So we've been doing a lot of talking to the students, kind of telling them what our day-to-day -day job involves and what kind of things we're looking for when we're looking at graduates and what kind of things help us stand out and get into the industry in the first place. There's a lot of things that I've been asked today that I wish I could have asked when I was a student. As a game student studying at the moment, um, it's a really nice opportunity to be able to have industry professionals so readily and easily available to go and network, to go and get genuine, useful advice. It can't be understated how helpful that is. I was lucky enough to take part in the recruitment panel, so basically uh, giving um, students, graduates, advice on these sort of entry-level um, opportunities and how to get into gaming, because once you get into gaming, your career sort of follows, but I'm sure as a lot of students find it can be just quite difficult to get that first job in a gaming environment. I think a day like today is, is invaluable. Uh, because of the range of industry experts that you have here, uh, covering a whole raft of gaming studios. And I think um, just within 10 miles of this building, there are 62 gaming companies. So the opportunities are out there. And uh, having a range of studios, a range of professionals and the experts from design to technical art to talk you through it and a concept artist, it's quite unique. 